much for this award and I'm really flattered to be here in front of you and standing up. It's not because this award is an amazing achievement for me, but it's an amazing achievement for the whole team. And for those of you who don't know what's a triathlon, it's something that is, consists of three very difficult parts. And all three of them really needed a lot of work. All three of them needed months of preparation. All three of them really pushed me to the limits. And the triathlon consists of biking, swimming, and running. <laughs> so, so excited. <laughs> now, how does it, this thing all begin? Just because I really want to thank everybody that took part in the whole game and also everybody that was helping me in the whole preparation. This began exactly four months ago. When somebody, one of my colleagues just came in and said quietly, oh, you know, there's something going on. Did you know about this threat not happening in four months? Let's go and do it. But the idea was that each one of us is doing one piece of it. <laughs> and we do it as a team. Now, it's not that we didn't want to do it this way, but while we were preparing and trying and trying, at some point we decided, why not do it by ourselves? Each one of us decided, let's go and do it, because we can do it. Because the moment we, we began training and we decided that, okay, we can do one part of it, we found out that we can do much more than we expected ourselves to do. And that's why it's an amazing achievement, not only for me, but for the whole team. Because each one of us participated in it. And each one of us did all the three parts. And each one of us deserves this award. Because this game really shows you how you can push your limits to such an extent that you never expected you can achieve. And the more you were trying, the more you would expand, extend your limits. And the more we were trying, the more we found out that the, the aim is actually moving. You can go forward and forward until you actually achieve it. And until you achieve even much higher. And even this thing could be much higher. Now, I would like to thank a few people actually for this award. And one of them is the organization, because it's an exceptional organization. First of all, it keeps the people fit and connects the people that are extraordinary in themselves just because they want to push their limits to higher levels. And second, it's just because it's such an organization that <coughs> organizes extraordinary events. It's pe putting people together with same similar ideas, putting people together that can actually follow their dreams. And I would also like to thank another organization. It's actually that my company, my colleagues. It's just because they would always support me. It's because they would always encourage me from the beginning until the end. They will sit with me and they wouldn't let me resign even in the moments when I thought it's not gonna happen. Even in the moments when I thought even one part is too much for me. But they would sit with me, they would encourage me and they would say, no, Mila, you're going to do it and we're going to do it together. It's an exceptional working place to be with because people want to be fit, because people care about themselves, people care about each one of us. And last but not least, really thank my family and friends just because they are side by side with me and they, all of them are here now. It's because this award is not only mine, it's everybody's. But this award showed me something else. It's two things that were holding me during the whole way. It's energy and persistence. With energy and persistence, it's not only that you can achieve what you want to achieve, you can achieve actually much more. And it's not a problem that you don't know where to finish and what your limits are. You might think they're much, much closer than they really are. And believe me, your limits can be pushed forward. And that's what this award taught me. This award showed me that I can do much more than I thought I could ever do. I really hope to see you there next year. <laughs> made up story though, I didn't <laughs> win it. <laughs>